When summer approaches, it's natural for people to want to spend more time outside with their family, friends, and pets. But sometimes, the heat can be too much. People may wear less clothing and more breathable fabrics to prevent becoming overheated outside. But dogs aren't able to shed their fur in order to stay cool. Today, we will tell you how hot is too hot for dogs to be outside. Number 6. Understanding the Impact of Heat on Dogs The Ideal Temperature Range for Dogs The ideal temperature for dogs typically falls between 60 degrees Fahrenheit and 70 degrees. That's 15 degrees Celsius to 20. This is when they are most comfortable, active, and at their best. However, they can tolerate a wider range of temperatures, but extreme heat is where we need to be cautious. Heat-Related Illnesses The three most common heat-related illnesses in dogs are heat stress, heat exhaustion, and heat stroke. These conditions can have serious consequences, so let's talk about the warning signs to watch out for. Heat Stress Heat stress, also known as heat exhaustion, is the early stage of heat-related illness. When a dog becomes overheated, they begin to pant heavily as their primary cooling mechanism. However, when it's excessively hot, this panting may not be enough to regulate their body temperature. Heat Exhaustion If the heat stress is not addressed promptly, it can progress to heat exhaustion. In this stage, the dog may appear weak, lethargic, and may continue to pant excessively. They might also drool more than usual. Heat Stroke Heat stroke is the most severe and life-threatening stage of heat-related illness. If left untreated, it can lead to organ failure and death. In addition to the symptoms of heat exhaustion, a dog suffering from heat stroke may have bright red gums, a very high body temperature, vomiting, diarrhea, loss of coordination, and even seizures. Number 5. Factors Influencing Heat Tolerance in Dogs It's important to note that different breeds and individual dogs have varying levels of heat tolerance. Factors influencing this include breed. Some breeds are better equipped to handle heat than others. For example, Nordic breeds with thick double coats are more comfortable in colder climates, while short-haired breeds may handle heat better. Age Puppies and senior dogs are less tolerant to extreme temperatures, including heat. They can't regulate their body temperature as effectively as young, healthy dogs. Health Dogs with underlying health conditions such as heart or respiratory problems are at higher risk for heat-related illnesses. Acclimatization Dogs that are used to hot weather are better adapted to it. However, even acclimated dogs have their limits, so it's essential to monitor them closely. Understanding the Mechanism of Heat Regulation in Dogs To fully appreciate the impact of heat on dogs, it's essential to understand their cooling mechanism. Dogs primarily cool themselves through evaporation, which occurs when they pant. As they breathe rapidly, moisture on their tongues and air passages evaporate, dissipating heat. However, this process becomes less effective in extremely hot and humid conditions. Pre-existing health conditions and medications It's crucial to be aware that certain health conditions such as obesity, brachycephalic syndrome, Common and flat-faced breeds and respiratory issues can make dogs more susceptible to heat-related illnesses. Additionally, some medications can impair a dog's ability to cool down. If your dog has pre-existing health conditions or takes medications, consult with your veterinarian to understand how these factors might affect their heat tolerance. Number 4. Sign of Heat Stress in Dogs Recognizing the early signs of heat stress in your dog is the first step in preventing more severe heat-related conditions. Let's discuss these symptoms and what you can do if you notice them. Excessive Panting Dogs regulate their body temperature by panting. However, when it's extremely hot, their panting can become rapid and excessive. If you notice your dog panting heavily, it's a clear sign that they're struggling to cool down. Relentlessness An agitated or relentless behavior is another indicator. 
If your dog can't seem to settle down, even in a shady spot, it's a sign that they may be overheated. Excessive drooling. While some dogs drool more than others naturally, excessive drooling, particularly when it's accompanied by other symptoms like panting, can indicate heat stress. Increased heart rate. You can check your dog's heart rate by feeling for their pulse, typically found on the inside of their thigh. Significantly increased heart rate is a sign of distress. Weakness or lethargy. If your normally energetic dog suddenly appears weak or lethargic, it's a red flag. They may be too hot and struggling to move comfortably. Bright red gums and tongue. An easy way to check for heat stress is to look at your dog's gums and tongue. If they appear bright red or even purple, it's an alarming sign. Normal gum color is pink. Immediate actions. Move to a cooler area. Get your dog out of the sun and into a cooler, shaded area. If you're at home, bring them indoors with air conditioning if possible. Offer water. Provide your dog with cool, fresh water to drink. You can also wet their tongue and the inside of their mouth to help cool them down. Avoid ice water as it can cause shock. Use a wet towel. Wet a towel or cloth with cool, not ice cold, water and gently place it on your dog's body particularly their armpits, groin, and neck. This aids in cooling them down. Use a fan. If available, direct a fan towards your dog to improve air circulation and assist in evaporative cooling. Avoid cold packs. Do not use ice packs or immerse your dog in ice water, as this can cause their body temperature to drop too rapidly, leading to shock. Contact a veterinarian. If the symptoms don't improve within a few minutes or if your dog's condition worsens, contact your veterinarian immediately for guidance. Monitor their temperature. If you have a pet thermometer, you can check your dog's temperature. Normal dog temperature ranges from 100.5 degrees Fahrenheit to 102.5. That's 38 degrees Celsius to 39.2 degrees. If their temperature exceeds 104 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius, it's a severe emergency. Number three, the temperature limits for dogs. Now let's get to the core of our discussion, the temperature limits for dogs. While it can vary depending on factors like breed and size, there are some general guidelines we can follow. Factors that influence tolerance. Different breeds and coat types have varying levels of heat tolerance. For example, double-coated breeds might be more heat-resistant than short-haired dogs. Age, health, and acclimatization also play a role. Specific Temperature Guidelines The American Veterinary Medical Association AVMA, recommends not leaving your dog outside when the temperature exceeds 85 degrees Fahrenheit. That's 29 degrees Celsius. In this range, most dogs are at risk of experiencing heat-related issues, hot pavement and surfaces. Remember, it's not just the air temperature. Hot pavement, sand, or concrete can be excruciating for your dog's paw pads. Always test the surface with your hand. And if it's too hot to touch, it's too hot for your dog to walk on. Number two, precautions and tips for hot weather. Prevention is key when it comes to keeping your dog safe in the heat. Here are some essential precautions and tips to follow during hot weather. Hydration. Always ensure your dog has access to fresh water. Dehydration can happen quickly in hot weather, so carry water on your walks and consider collapsible bowls for outings. Shade and rest. Provide shade and rest breaks during outdoor activities. If you're at a park or the beach, Consider bringing a portable canopy or umbrella to create a comfortable shaded spot. Avoid peak heat hours. Try to plan outdoor activities during cooler times of the day. The early morning and late evenings are usually the best times for exercise and play. Paw protection. Protect your dog's paw pads from hot surfaces by using dog boots. They can prevent burns and discomfort while walking on hot pavement. Cooling products. Consider using cooling mats or vests to help regulate your dog's temperature. These products are a great way to keep them comfortable in the heat. Never leave dogs in cars. 
Never under any circumstances leave your dog in a parked car during hot weather. Even with the windows cracked, temperatures inside the car can soar to dangerous levels within minutes. Number 1. Conclusion and Responsible Dog Ownership In conclusion, it's our responsibility as dog owners to be mindful of our pet's well-being during hot weather. By understanding the signs of heat stress, respecting temperature limits, and taking necessary precautions, we can ensure our furry companions stay safe and healthy. Spread the word about the dangers of extreme heat to fellow dog owners. The more awareness we raise, the better we can collectively protect our four-legged friends. Remember, our dogs rely on us to keep them safe. Be a responsible pet owner and always prioritize your dog's comfort and health, especially when the mercury rises. Please share this information with your friends and family to help ensure the safety of all the beloved dogs out there. If you have any questions or would like to share your own tips and experiences, feel free to leave a comment below. Please subscribe to Amazing Dogs. Thanks for watching.